in Seattle, the 605-foot-tall Space Needle, built as a symbol of the 1962 World's Fair, once lured visitors with its spectacular views. Now, the windows have all blown out, destroyed by corrosion from Seattle's rain. Our glass is expected to last 20, 25 years. But if you didn't have the proper maintenance, as corrosion gets in there, that's going to pinch on the glass and eventually cause cracks. Those cracks will become failures, and that'll be the thing that, that kind of opens up. In the time of humans, it took 24 people and $2 million a year to maintain the needle's structure and safety. While the tall structure was an occasional target for lightning, the Space Needle will not perish by fire. After 50 years, the exterior paint has flaked away and the steel faces corrosion, some of it from an unexpected source. Water stored in the trees that have reclaimed the city. The trees will dump leaves and pine needles on the ground, and some of this will fall on the base. If the leaves fell in this area, if you had a stack of leaves here, those leaves would ca capture moisture and they would hold the moisture, and they would hold it for weeks and months at times. And not only that, they're somewhat acidic, uh, and rain is somewhat acidic, so the, the whole process could really accelerate corrosion. Although the Space Needle will stand for many decades to come, the corrosive power of water will one day bring it down. While the needle stands, its former high-altitude restaurant is a roosting place for peregrine falcons, the fastest creatures on Earth, swooping down on their prey at more than 270 miles an hour. Peregrines naturally nest on cliffs, so putting a nest on a, a little ledge outside a window really is similar to nesting on a little ledge on a cliff. So if there's pigeons living below a nest, that's a good home. Two hundred years after people. In what was once Seattle, corrosion has also been eating away at the needle's supports. When the roof starts to leak, moisture starts to get inside the structure, and that moisture causes the steel to want to corrode. The weakest link probably is, is going to be some of these joints, uh, some of the support bracing that's in place. You know, those are the kind of things that have the most opportunity for corrosion to kind of get into some cracks, take hold, and then expand from there. Weakened from 100 wounds over 200 years, the symbol of hope and progress from 1962 gives up the fight.